Hello, internets! It's time for the next series of Let's Play a Game with Monsoon. And as you can see, this time it will be Saints Row 4. Uh, game came out, oh, I guess it's been a little over a month now. And I've <coughs> played through the campaign mode three times already. Uh, awesome game, terribly fun. I can definitely see myself uh, not really being able to go back to uh, previous games in the series because where are my superpowers? Why aren't my superpowers working? Grr, rage. Anyway, um, let us get started. Let's go ahead and get started on a new campaign. Make a new game. Yes, yes, I know there's an autosave present. It's an awesome game. It's been an awesome series. It is a truth universally acknowledged. And I love that how now and again a situation arises this intro kind of references the fact that when it first came on the scene, the game was seen as kind of a, a, a Grand Theft Auto clone. They were decried for being pretenders to the you know, throne. The, the whole pretender to the throne bit right there basically is like, yeah, yes, we know. Everyone thinks that this started out as being, oh, we're as awesome as GTA, look how good we are. And it really ended up splitting off in its own direction. I mean, uh, Grand Theft Auto series was started with GTA 4 is, is looked really you know, we've gotten very serious and gotten away from the somewhat silliness of the concept of, of an open-world criminal game. Now, I haven't played GTA 5 yet, because they haven't released it on PC yet. Um, I've seen some footage. It looks like a decent game. I'll probably get it when it comes out for the PC. I just can't do these kind of games with console controller. Every time I see helicopters flying over a mountain, I keep expecting to see Gary Berghoff looking off in the distance, watching them come in as suicide is painless place. Mike is dead. Are you fucking kidding me? Mike is not dead. I'm alive. I'm alive and kicking. The battery because I was busy coordinating an international assassination. Hey, can we go back to the part about this being a setup? It's not a setup. The intel is good. You trust this lady? Of course we trust her. It's in the script. Oh, she's tied with the KGB. I feel a lot better. Look, Bert and I worked with her too. She's fine. Oh yeah, I'm sure she's great at putting someone in a fucking body bag. That doesn't mean we should. The Saints are excellent at putting people in body bags. That's kind of what we do. Showtime. Gotta wonder though if the uh, people that they are here to ambush you know, heard a helicopter We're coming in because those aren't exactly quiet. You're a real people person, aren't you? I'm sorry, is this a counter-terrorist operation or a Saints flow shoot? I'm shot. Archero to come. Follow me. Once again, we start out with a boss that could really be either gender and any race. And then this time it could even even have any accent, because you, you don't we hear the boss speak because the microphone's broken. Although that body armor looks business. very masculine. We know what do you? Look, lady, this motherfucker knows how to get shit done. Don't you worry about me. What's security? Uh, looks Let's like a bunch of dudes in window. turbans. That's we what they look like. We'll only need to worry about the guards on foot. How many of those are there? Don't know about the numbers inside, but there are about eight marching the perimeter. On my signal, we... Oh, hell. <laughs> Here come more guys. Hala Hala Akbar! Hala Jihad! Shabab! That's how awesome the boss is. So much for subtlety. Don't worry about it, honey. Subtlety is not really our thing. Come on, this way. Yeah, the saints are not known for quiet entrances. <laughs> what? They're going down the pipe. Don't look at me like that. Don't judge me. 
Chris, are you there? Do, 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 do. What are we walking into? The intelligence I'm looking at suggests... Hold on. All right, that's enough Drop of that joke. Way. Wait a minute. Your hammer is... Was that Matt Miller? Kinsey, be nice. But seriously, what the hell? Matt Miller is a brilliant hacker, a venerated agent of MI6, and a key member of our operation. And the fact that he tried to kill us. What's past is past. We are all working together now. Let's focus on the job. As I was saying... Hold that thought, Matt. Guards ahead. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. Stag crates. Oh, Hadn't noticed that for last time. Let's take him out quietly. Quiet? Oh, fine. If I have to do it quietly, I suppose I can. Hey, you, come here. I want to show you something. Stab, stab. It's nice. Matt, you were saying? The nuke is stashed deep in the compound. It's likely primed and ready to go. Getting booted from the U.S. sent Cyrus Temple off the deep end, but teaming up with terrorists? Seriously? And we're in. Get my back. Get your back. Cyrus' soldiers everywhere, so be alert. Attention! Bang. Attention shoot, shoot. Shoot you, Hank. Shoot you. Shoot. Take it personal. Why would? I should have killed you in Steelboard. Or maybe take it personal. You own Steelboard. Just a little person. Monologuing. Our leaders failed America by letting you live. Time to destroy Washington. Nothing can stop me now. Especially you. Uh huh. Cyrus has seriously lost. I doubt he ever had it. Kenzie, what's going on? Shit! Our side's bombing the compound! Oh, That's nice of them. No, wait, no, what? dropping the bomb! Just get them to stop! I'll do what I can, but work quick. Boom! What the fuck? Where to now, then? Don't swear. I got this. Come here, bitch. This way, people. Go Pierce. Every mission has its bumps. Bump? You call that a bump? You're lying. Good one. Pierce, come with me. You two go through that door. On. Let's see how you can handle yourself, Mr. Celebrity. We'll be on mic. Handle myself? Shit. We should be really close to the missile final now. Stay alert. Cyrus is such a bird when it comes to security. Is he a Josh Burke? Target, but we're looking at a stockpile of explosives and chemicals here. I can't tell what kind. And chemicals, lady. What else you need to know? Well, might, have, might be handy to know what exactly what we're dealing with, Pierce. Apart from, you know, dudes who like to shoot me in the face. Because I deal with that on a daily basis. I shoot five people in the face before breakfast each day. Yo, we're here. Target is just ahead. Target's next room. Damn it! Good, good, good. Pardon me, sir. Knock, knock. Avon calling. This shit is coming out <laughs> Yes, you may all make fun of my slow-mo shooting skills. Non-existent they, though they may be. I love how the subtitle comes up like a minute before the actual speech. Face meat wall. Alright, back in the game. Child. Makes me remember back to the, uh, the mission in the Saints Row 3 where you disguise yourself as this guy. You know, you go to the plastic surgeon, you get yourself made up with black him. And at that point, your uh, your body was quite literally a temple. Oh, I'm oh. liver. Oh, 
so that's what a colon looks like. You're not leaving here. <laughs> that's what you think. Best to just give up now. I don't think so, Mister T1000. Oh no, she's not a nuke. The missile is targeting Washington. What are you doing? Don't you get it? The boss is sacrificing themselves to save us all. This is a I shall save the nation. I shall save you. I shall save the country. Oh, okay. Maybe not one of my better ideas. But hey, we'll work with it. I was just a fun-loving girl in dreadlocks, but you, you saw me as more than that. We snap at each other sometimes, and I don't always understand your methods, but there's no one I'd rather follow into battle. Ah, uh, see, this right here looks important. You said, hey, Piz, how would you like to be the face of the saints? And I was all, I, I... I'm gonna miss you too, Pierce! I love you, bro! In a totally get not gay and manly way! It's great to hear there, Matt. A little late, but... You know... Whatever. And... Dismount! I love these games. I love that they start you out with just the craziest, sh craziest shit. And he sticks the landing. Well, while I'm here, might as well make myself comfortable. Yay, we have the Adoration of America! And the Presidency of the United States! Press all the buttons! Chief of Stash. Stick Chief of Stash. Ooh. That brings whole new meaning to the to the job. Benjamin motherfucking King. Vice President Keith David. Vice President Admiral Anderson. Alright, so. Here we go. And of course, we're going to do the character customization gun thing. And download the character that I've created. This is basically I uploaded my Saints Row 3 Let's Play character, downloaded her into Saints Row 4, discovered that some of the costume options weren't available anymore, so I you know tweaked it around, re-uploaded, and we'll start with this. Yes, we shall accept. And hmm, are we happy with this? I think we're satisfied with this for the time being. Let's get this party started. This is a problem. It's not a problem. You alienated part of America. I alienated crazy people. You couldn't resist, could you? Jeez, it's not you two. <laughs> this is a problem. I keep trying to explain just that, getting but it from the both sides. won't listen. Poverty is a problem. Apartheid is a problem. This, this is just a couple of... Here's the latest approval ball. We lost 20 points. We can get them back. They're at 20 points. I'll admit that's a little lower than anticipated. So you agree you have a problem? Nope, you do. You're the communications director. Fix this. Can you give me 100% employment? No. no. Will you get married? Fuck no. Fuck no. Then I think we're in trouble. King, can you have this naysayer assassinated? Not when you say it publicly. You're more fun as a gang leader. We have a country to run. Fun isn't part of the equation. There's a septic truck when you need one. <laughs> Poor boss. Thought that being the president would be all fun and games, but nope. That's a lot of responsibility to take on. Oh, I hope Keith has some good news. Alrighty. Let's wander on down. Here's part of this job. Huh. Press conferences. Hey, look, it's the America gun. Interesting. I had not noticed that before. 
Listen, we've got enough clout right now for one major bill, not both. What do you want me to push forward? Do you want to be the president who cured cancer or Cure the cancer. president who solved world hunger? Solve world hunger. If you've played this game, you know either one, neither one really makes a difference. But fuck cancer. Time to make cancer public enemy number one. Good choice. Fuck it right in its ear hole. I hope Kinsey's got the peanut gallery handled. Now, you listen here. If you think you can cram your agenda past Congress, you are in for a rude awakening. You hear me? Now, let me tell you a little something about the greatest Republican. word in politics. Filibuster. Did I, did I make a political joke? I'm sorry. How about we... Allow me to retort. Yes. You weren't needing that gut, were you? Hey, Doris! We still playing tennis later? Look around a little bit. Pretty pictures. Oleg and I are about to head over to Camp David to watch some Nightblade. Yep. You down? Sure thing. Boom! Shit, how could I pass that up? Right on. I'm your number one fan! <laughs> <laughs> number one fan, nice meet number 12 Oleg. boot. Nice. President's words, words were taken, taken out, of out of context. Kinsey, what's the right context for? And I quote, I'm the patron saint of America. We should probably look into changing the Pledge of Allegiance to one nation under me. That's I would think question. I wouldn't Thanks. have taken that shit seriously. You know, especially considering I the boss oh, is not terribly serious about most things. I would have figured, yeah, well, the boss is joking. Uh -huh. That was kind of funny. They but then again, I'm not What's going on? the sort to be offended by something like that. By aliens, aliens? Go. what? This is serious. You've touched me. You know that Kinsey's been saying the same thing. When did you start taking Kinsey seriously? When the people who helped us save the world said we should. All right, I'll swing by after I. Get <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Hi, Dr. Nick! Ladies and gentlemen, this is not a time for fear, but a time for celebration. Uh, Today, the best and brightest among you will find... You know, I, I know it's a silly video game, Empire. especially with the fact that it's in the Saints Row series. I probably shouldn't take it too seriously, but... What the hell? Why is... Why would he even attack her like this? I mean, I've, I've played through the spirit, little text, adve text adventure games that you can do, you. and it sort of explains it, but it still doesn't seem like a very good reason for him to invade the planet Splendid. and kidnap a bunch of people. But oh well. If I'm questioning the motivations of a villain in the Saints Row series, I really Hands need off. to get the life. Alrighty. Uh, get it. Let me have an executive order. Lots of them. Guns, guns, more guns. We need all the guns. I told them I wanted a gun in every room and two in every hallway. Shoot. There you are. Thank God you're all right. You okay? Where's Matt? Upstairs, trying to find out what's happening. What is happening? All out war, by the looks of it. Well, that's not cool. That's intended as a nod to the. I'm meeting up with Matt. I'll be in touch with Sixties Batman be with Adam West and Burt Ward, or if it's just something to do. Oh, beautiful, beautiful guns! Yay, women! Ooh, look at you, Second Amendment solutions! Come on, this way! Where's it? Pick up all those guns. What? That just went back to my trusty pistols. No, he's not teeth. Remember this face one. and face. Shit, what the fuck is going on? Die, alien motherfucker! Here, Ben! Let's go! Shit, player! Save yourself! 
Fuck that! Save me! Not my homies. Dead. I did this for you. Leave my country alone. Tell my wife I had another wife. Apparently he's. I regret nothing. Utah. Ha! You assholes pissed off the wrong POTUS! I'm gonna find that other mother. These enemies identified by some invaders. I'll trade for this. Man, I'm in the South Portico. We're on my way, but there's alien fuck nuggets in my way. I still think I'm just a take out my cabinet. I'll rip your fucking head off. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Matt, hold on to me! Hush up! Matt! God damn it! Alright, switch to weapons. Pistols. They're not all that awesome. They're not upgraded. That was right. Holy shit. How many of you are there? Way too many. Bert to Ernie. Bert to Ernie. Activate South Portico defenses. Let's okay, do this, you gorgeous thing. America! Fuck yeah! There's no way to fight a lady. Come and get it! I'll shoot every one of you out of the sky! I knew those I hours played play Space Invaders would come useful one day. Snatch my cabinet! You think you can come here and fuck my country? Still got me back, guys. What am I supposed to kill you if you keep moving? This is for me. This one's for Uncle Sam. This one's just because I want. There's one for Bobo the Space Monkey. There's one for Poe. One for little Johnny. There's one because I had ammo left. Another rather silly game series. Old school. Old school 2, really. I played Old School 3. It was mediocre. It crashed a lot. Are you You blew it up! You maniacs! You shot down my battleship. Yes! Yes! Eat it! Uh oh. Not good. This happens quite frequently, more than it really should. They shoot things down and they run into me. That's not cool. Alright. Time to face whoever's behind this shit. Oh, ah! Trick you! No! Why do you humans enjoy leaping so much? Get off my lawn, you son of a bitch! You didn't count on me, did you? Well, hello there. Welcome aboard. I'm gonna have you stuffed and mounted, you alien fuck. Punchy, punchy, punch, punch. Now, now. Not so fast. Say goodbye. What? Cheater! Cheaters! Oh! Face! <laughs> Did you really think you could stop me? Shit! Oh, human arrogance. 
Is there anything more charming? Oh! Fucking hell! Oh! oh I'm gonna... Do oh. what exactly? Uh -oh. Huh? My everything. Bravado me to death? <laughs> I'm going to have fun breaking you. Well, kind of makes me wonder just how far into the presidency that was, because it happened five years after those previous events, and they later in the game they mentioned about having an awesome second term, so that's, that had to have been sometime in the first term, you know, that they would have had an awesome second term. Uh, hey. Good morning. <laughs> Goodness me, what a dream. My goodness gracious! I love this, the, all the little details. And this, the walk. The, the strut. The happy-go-lucky. Oh, gosh, <laughs> what a glorious day! Would have been almost a more amusing if this part had been in black and white. Morning, dear. I made your favorite breakfast. Yay, breakfast! Oh, Mr. Pancakes. King from across the street is going out of town for a few weeks. He was wondering if you could check his mail for him. Oh, Press X to eat pancake. pancake. I'm sure he has some crazy new get rich scheme. Oh, that Pierce. That's a big old stack Such of pancakes, car. too. And someone named Dex stopped by earlier. I didn't recognize him, so I just sent him away. Alright, I guess we're done with the pancakes. She must think it's a big I stack of pancakes, too, because you know, she only ate like just two bites. It, dear. Sure thing! I'll go get the paper now, sweetheart. I did only I, neighbor. Shut up, Flanders. I wonder what's new in the world today. Stretch, reach, you can get it. Yay! You ready to meet the fine people of Steelport? Well, <laughs> get in the car. Let's go, Deputy Fife. Wait, don't I usually drive? It's your world. Go ahead. Into the car we go. Boy, they Take sure are nice anxious to meet you. End. They? <laughs> Relax and drive well, through the town. You do have a queer sense of humor. Is it just me, or does everything look kind of... Weird. Now, what's that you say? Just a nagging feeling, like this is all... Can't wait to get out to the lake this weekend. I hear the fish are really biting. The fish are... <gasps> what are you talking about? Don't you worry now. We're almost there. There is definitely something wrong with this yeah. car. Yeah, well, more than just this car. It's this whole world. Like oh, driving you insane, now. like a splinter in your mind. Well, here we are. Why don't you glad hand a bit? We got time. Smile and wave. Smile and wave. Greetings to the fine peoples of Steelport. Ow! Ow. Oh. <laughs> Can I get a picture? Why, certainly, my good man. I'd Aww. be glad to allow you to have to take a photograph. Me. Looks like it's time. Your public is waiting. All right, let's go into the diner. Get some of that diner grub. Oh my stars, it's the president. Hi, how are... What the f We don't use that kind of language here in Steelport. Yeah, you do. You do now. Oh shit! Where the sh are you fing trying to pull? <laughs> Work in the car! What is this new 
fuck away from here. Hello? 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 Is that you, Jesus? Kinsey? What is this? Kinsey, where are you? Finally! Listen oh. to me. No time to explain, but you have to break free. Break free from what, Kinsey? The place you're in isn't real. Whatever it's having you do, you need to stop. What? I'm just driving. Okay, good. There's a park nearby. Head there and give me a sec. Brace yourself. Brace for Jesus Whoa. H! <laughs> Where'd my car go? Dude, where's my car? I need some more time before I can get you out. It'd be really helpful if you could just, you know, just be you. Be me? Simulation yep. Is all about me Start killing dudes. Like That's what you do best. Order, all the things you hate. Go forth. Unleash hell. Nice to know I have your blessing, Kinsey. Keep it up! The simulation is resisting, but just keep going! Always happy to show off. You need to do more. Bigger! Hold on, I'm sending you something. Find the cat fountain. I left you a present. Gosh, I feel like I should be hearing some music swell. from The Legend of Zelda. Let there be explosions. Blow up all the things. Start you out with mayhem mission. You're doing great. The simulation is... Oh, no. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. What, what's going on, Kinsey? I love action. Boom! No, no, the thing's up. <laughs> Couldn't leave well enough alone, could you? You had to push and push and push. Push. I hope you've enjoyed your last moments. Suck on this, asshole! Ride my rockets! Come back here, you. That's right. You don't fuck with the saints, you don't fuck with America. Asshole. Zinyak, all he wants is everything. I'm impressed. Where the hell are- oh, Fuck me. I should have realized a prison of peace would never hold a sociopath like yourself. I'm more of a puck I always wondered how the ancients saw things in the, in the stars. Are you trying to kill me or sleep with me? That's a constellation I couldn't recognize. See, there you go, those mixed messages again. Then allow me to be perfectly clear. I am the architect of your reality. I build what I want. I destroy what I want. Hey, if you can build anything, you want to add some strip clubs? Means nothing. See, that's what it is, really. We're all just playing around inside Zinyak's version of The Sims. That's what he gets for turning on uh, free will. Fighting back is pointless, my friend. There's nowhere to run. You belong to me. Now, <laughs> What's with you and my trachea? What the hell, dude? I'm going to place you in your new home. Try to run again, and I'll destroy your pitiful planet. Did you ever? My friends, each of you are guilty of crimes against the Zin Empire. But today is your lucky day. Oh, really? Today, you get to be a part of a new work release program. Yay! 
swear your fealty. We swear. And I will empower you to be wardens of Simulation 31. You will have one purpose. Torment the President of the United States. Yay, I love tormenting world leaders. That, the world is yours to toy with. Ravage it. Indulge in your basest desire. There is a no part of me that would like to have seen more about leave the prisoner you know, alive. What the uh, what the boss's broke. presidency was like apart from it. just that one brief scene. Go now and tear their world asunder. Have a pleasant day. Alrighty. Well, I do believe that's gonna just about do it for this episode of Let's Play Saints Row 4. I'm gonna wait until I get control back. And then we will call it for this episode. Oh, different. Now where am I? Come in, President. Can you hear me? I hear you all right. Only, uh, hey, how? how am I hearing you, considering I don't have a phone? I just patched myself into your simulation and projected my voice through the audio system. You should be able to hear me from anywhere. And you don't have to yell. Okay, because you chattering okay. in my skull isn't annoying. Kinsey, I'm unarmed. Get me out now. I can't do that until I backtrace your signal to your physical blah, body. Blah, 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 then, blah, 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 blah. So you might want to go buy a gun. Great. Retail therapy at Friendly Fire. Yay, buying guns. Alright, so. Let's call it right there. Pause for a moment whilst I give a little bit of an outro. Thank you for watching this first episode of Let's Play Saints Row 4 with Monsoon. It was fun. I love these games, so I'm going to keep recording and play through the whole thing again. And until next time, as always, enjoy the games that you play.